Thank you, Kerry. Had you fellow three-year-old Philly Pacers, Western Duel, Irish Alley, Gothic Lady, Pacific Baroness, Can I Peach? Cast it at home. Family heirloom on the outside. There to go. Up and pacing, that's Can I Peach going right out for the lead for Steve Salerno. Getting away second at Western Duel. He had the turn third. Irish Yale pacing fourth. Gothic Lady racing fifth. Pacific Baroness sixth on the inside. Castanet Hall treading the field. Family heirloom as they race around the turn. Going to the first quarter mark. Up and moving on the outside. Gothic Lady and Dave Ballone to the front end. Opening quarter. 29 seconds. Passing it into the first time. Coming to the 3 8. Kenai Peach racing second. Pacing third. Western Duel. Fourth is Irish Alley. Racing fifth. Pacific Baroness. Here comes Ron Pearson. Family heirloom. On the move on the outside from way back. Castanet Hall trails the field. He into the clubhouse turn. Coming to the outside. Pacific Baroness now first up from fifth. At the half. 58. Eight and two. Second quarter, 29 and two. To the backside they go. It's Gothic Lady with the lead. Racing second, Can I Peach? Racing third, Western Duel. Fourth on the outside, Pacific Baroness. Racing fifth, Irish Alley. Sixth on the outside. That's Family Heirloom and Trinity the Field. Castanet Hall going to the three quarter mark. The leader remains Gothic Lady. Can I Peach? Racing second. Three quarters, one. 27 and 3. Backside 29 and 1. Continue to close on the outside. Pacific Baroness now third, inching up. Eighth of a mile to go. Gothic Lady the leader. Inside, Can I Peach, Lightning Lane, Western Duel. Down the stretch they come. Gothic Lady with the lead. Throw it away as she pleases for Dave Pella. Can I Peach second? Photo. Show one 55 and two. Final half 57. Final quarter 27. We might have four. We might have a violation of the lightning lane there. And you might be saying, well, who was it? The five. Can I peach? Coming down the stretch, appeared to come to the inside, and the inquiry light has come on, and the five is flashing. It looked like coming off the turn, he was gapped out quite a bit, and it didn't look like he was picking up very much ground on Gothic Lady. Uh, tell us about her. Well, same thing. She's been racing against the best fillies in the country, and Bob's first string electrical art there and those things, and uh, just coming here and getting slow fractions, getting things her own way. She's very strong through the wire, and... Uh, you know, like I said, last year I watched her a few times up there in Canada, and she was stepping around, but perfect tonight. Did Bob send instructions for you on how to drive her, uh, trying to find the secret of her, or, or simply uh, he trusts you? <laughs> That's funny. The last You asked that. The last time I talked to Bob, I came up with a strategy, and uh, after 18 moves, the horse finally got tired. He, he didn't say anything this time. Thank God I redeemed myself. Way to go. A uh, winner here tonight, Gothic Lady, uh, back in the winner's circle with David Blown in the Adio Bolo. Thank you, gentlemen. Well, our ninth race is uh, another division of the Arden Downs 3 -year -old.